Well, guys, that happened. It's a sad day over here at Snowbank with another, what we all think is a rug pool. Right now, I'm in the current process of unstaking my snowbank. I wasn't really looking at the prices. I wasn't really looking at the Discord throughout Thanksgiving because I was, I was having Thanksgiving. I was having dinner. I was with my family. But something happened that I need to get this information out to everybody before we all lose our shirts. I mean, I already did. I lose my shirt, but lost a lot. I put in maybe a grand, maybe 1200 bucks into Snowbank, thinking that it's going to be amazing because it had this new feature where you can actually borrow. A couple other things I really liked about it. The Discord was amazing, everyone was so cool. And this happened. Let me share my screen. Let me show what I mean. So if you hop over to the announcements over here, we are sorry for what they did with the snow dog experiment. Pretty much what they try to do is they try to do a meme coin. And this meme coin thing went terribly, terribly wrong. Everybody, they, every, all the developers here screw it up and everything. Total, oh, total mess, total, total mess. And because of that, it screwed up their main project. Because they screwed up this little meme coin that they're trying to do, this is the meme coin on the Avalanche network. Because they, they screwed that up, it screwed up their main snowbank project. Now I had high, high hopes for this. Not, not the fact that I had money in it or anything, but the fact that, yeah, I just I had high hopes for this. Because I believe that this was just doing something different that different than what Wonderland was doing. I mean, it was similar, a similar concept, Wonderland, but I was doing it better, as I'm trying to say. And usually that's what success kind of made out of, you know. If you want to quickly have some success in something, you know, if you want to do something, find somebody already did it successfully, just do it better, is what I kind of understand. Which is why I got onto this. And the Discord, everybody seems so chill and so cool in here. Discord is funny as S H I T. Everyone was so funny in here. But the problem was, is the developers totally screwed up this project. Totally screwed it up. And now, because of that, you can't go back on that, really. You just can't, you know? You fuck up one thing, they don't trust you. And this is what happens. Uh, get out of snowbank now. <laughs> so it saves invest in snowbank now? I wouldn't. It's fear was the, the snow dog debacle, debacle, whatever it means, what the word is. It's because they screwed up another project. People lost hope in them. And everyone's popping out now. And so am I. Because I know that, oops, let me share over here. So right now I'm in the process of unstaking it. It does take a second to actually do this, it's kind of annoying, but I'm unstaking it right now. And I just want to go through this video to show you exactly how to do so. For anybody that hopped in a snowbank to know how to unstake. Uh, it's pretty simple. If you know how to stake it already, I'm assuming you probably know how to unstake it. Click on state. <laughs> but let me talk to you guys a little bit about why, why the community is so powerful, why the community really makes a project. Because the community is your investors, first of all. And if you, if you, made like the first thing they did here is they generated an amazing community that was funny as shit okay on their channel everybody was really cool 
Everybody believed in this project. There was so much hype for this project. But the problem that happened is that they screwed up their other project. They shouldn't even have had the other project. They should have just focused on what they had going on. And I see there's a lot of other rug pulls. For example, uh, st Stack Toad, I'm not saying it's a rug pull just yet, um, but it did the same thing this did. Because Stack Toads, they try to make, look, let me show you. Now yeah, back on my Discord over here. Because Stack Toads, what they try to do is they try to do they try to make so much money. They not stack toads. Yeah, stack toads. Stack toads. They try to make disto toads. They try to make Genesis toads, space toads, and all these other things. And it just it took away from the focus of the main project, the main concept, is because they're too focused on making money, kind of, you know. And I should have seen this coming because I saw it happen with stack toads. The fact that they were trying to focus on other things, which all inevitably, inevitably screwed up their main project. I should have seen this before. I should have seen this, so it's coming because I saw this in exactly the stack toes, the NFT project. It's crazy how these things can happen, but what are you gonna do? <laughs> So guys, honestly, I recommend getting out of it now before it even drops. I um, mean, take the L. Shit happens. Uh, so I'm currently doing it right now. I just converted. I unstaked it just now. I'm converted back to AVAX. <coughs> Ooh, excuse me. This happens. You know, some of the things that that made this project successful was the fact that it was doing something that's already proven to be successful in Wonderland, but do it better. What they screwed up was the fact that they lost our trust because they effed up S-Dog. And this is actually in their Twitter before. Somebody tweeted uh, about S-Dog, how, how they were selling off a mass amount of S-Dog or something like that. Well, no, previous when, when the memes coin started, they previously bought a bunch of S dog and to rise up the price. And then, then they promoted it to their group and then they did the sale and everything. And then as the price increased, they had already had a huge amount as the price increased, they started, started dropping it with decrease the price. Right. And I mean, most people here didn't want to see it. Right. This is kind of pre Thanksgiving. Um, I was honestly, I should have got out just there just based upon how they're just treating S-Dog and how it's treating those people, you know? I was thinking that was two different projects couldn't correlate, but it does, you know, because Snowbank is made by the same developers as S-Dog. It's pretty much kind of the same project. And they just, because they had the intentions of, instead of just making a lot of money, doing it the wrong way by buying a whole bunch, price goes up once they, once they release it and then slowly selling it off, like that's just a trend for failure, you know? So I'm trying to say is I don't trust this. Even if it does go up again, I don't trust it. I'm as honest, I wanna get back into it. Even if it does start to go up in price. No. And the scary part about this is that these, these management, these developers, can just delete every, the worst thing about crypto is that they can just delete their username and make another username and try to do something different. That's where you gotta be very, very careful. But, hey, that happens. That's why I always suggest that don't invest in something that you don't know. Don't invest money where, if you, if you can't afford to lose it. That's just how it kinda goes. But no worries, guys. On to the next project. And I'll see you soon, guys. I'll see you at the top. <laughs>